little striper mixed in with them. Right there. Is it? Yeah, it is. Right over here. The biggest one in there. I don't know if you can see him. It's a little striper. The camera's even getting no, him. There he is right there. there. Might be a couple of them. So today I'm going to fish the setting sun in this rip over here. There appears to be some bird activity. Um, flicking the fly today. Um, a little bit windy, but it's a good, it's a very good wind for the corner that I'm in. <laughs> I like the way that sounds. Uh, I think it's about 12 to 18 mile an hour, but it's adding to the cast, not taking away from it. Well, somewhat added, but a little, little bit milder wind would be perfect, but uh, definitely 100% doable, and the uh, place just seems alive. So I'm going to start by throwing a, a bucktail, chartreuse white, 360 pattern. Um, I got white for day, and I have two of these, white for day, I uh, got the black and purple for night. And uh, I'm just looking to stick, you know, if I can stick one or two fish, I'll be happy. There are fish out there, they just seem to be ranging a bit out. So, just maybe a matter of them getting in close enough to get them. You probably can get a 70, 80 feet consistent. Yeah, they are now. It's a size one hook. I like the smaller hook. They're just going to throw better when you're level with the water. And just utter chaos in that rip over there. Utter chaos. I can see them breaking water, birds diving. That is a tight wall of fish. Hopefully they don't break this way. what this is maybe a small glue still on we even get a look at him now he's digging in good not huge but let's see what he is at least whoa Whoa, that's a nice size fish, bigger than I thought. Looks like a blue for sure. I think we might lose him. Definitely a blue. Now he's fighting wild. You don't want to be caught. Only got 15 pound leader on there. There he is. Come on, buddy. I want my fly back. You can go, but I want my fly. Oh, nice hook set. Whoa! I don't think he might not be going anywhere. Unless he turns and gets that hook on the other side of his mouth. He's got a bit of life left in him, too. Come on, I want my fly. Ooh, better nice sized fish. My fly is in the bag. Oh. Beautiful hook set. Let's get him on his way. 
He had a bit of life in him too. Now I'm just gonna check my leader. Nick's it looks good. Maybe. Let me show you what he took. I was using a a, uh, a Bucktail 360. Shredded up the fly a bit. I love those for bass. They are like my preferred bass teaser as well. You can see I have night colors. So I am using a floating line today. And uh, just water's fairly shallow here, so I'm not worried about that. I like the floating line because I can lift it and throw it a lot easier than a sinking type of line. Uh, I got about a 10 foot, maybe 11 foot leader. Give the fly a little bit more drop and uh, size one uh, bucktail I'm working today. Uh, nine weight or nine weight on my rod and line. Now this fly, you can see it's layered. You can see the red thread underneath. So it's a little fuller than, a, than a, my surf teasers that I like to throw in the deep summer, early winter. Got a bigger, wider profile, a stained water. They can see it better. And it breathes nicely. It pushes a lot of water. I like that. All right. Got a little bit slow. Those birds disappeared. I see them up in the air now. Maybe they see something. So maybe we'll get one more. Maybe not. But night's coming and I got a few other spots I want to try later. Okay, I just hooked up again. Feels about the same size as the other guy. Might be a little smaller. Likely he's a blue. Oh, a little bass. Maybe there'll be some bigger guys out tonight. I hope those big blues don't be passing him through. Now let's get him on his way. Alright, I'm gonna uh, head about some, uh, poison ivy, but um, I'm gonna head about, uh, not bad, a striper, a bluefish, uh, bluefish was better than I thought, he was really started fighting hard once he started uh, edging in, but uh, the bite seemed to subside a bit, and the fish and the baits either went down or out, a couple of birds working, but nothing spectacular. So I'm gonna go uh, head about, hit somewhere else and maybe do something else, but not a bit out. A uh, couple hours with the fly rod, wanna get a fish or two and that's what we did. But uh, let me get going and uh, thanks for watching. And uh, please like, dislike, uh, comment, whatever you have to say, love them all. Uh, subscribe to the channel or not. And uh, remember always, fish your way. And thanks again for watching.